Can I take a brief intersectional moment to talk about class for a second instead of race? Yeah, sure. Um, would, is there anyone here who would not throw a punch at Matthew given the opportunity? Oh, I would love to punch Matthew. Oh my goodness. I, see, I feel like he would talk me out of I, it though. Oh no, he wouldn't talk me out of it. But he would talk high school me out of it. Oh my, he would so succeed in high school me. Okay, that's, I would have to think about that okay. one. I don't know, I was, I was more violent in high school. Oh yeah, see, there you go. <laughs> I, I just, the, the moment where he's talking to Frankie, all holier than thou, smug, mm, and he acknowledges that if he came forward, he wouldn't be punished, that there would be no real consequences for him, that the only consequences would be for his father, whom he doesn't particularly care about anyway, and that, it, it, but, but he doesn't want to do that. Because Alpha doesn't want him to. Because Alpha doesn't want him to. He cares so much about what Alpha wants all of a sudden. But if he did it, Alpha, like, they can't throw out Alpha and not throw out Matthew. Right. They'd have to throw out, they'd have to either throw out both of them or throw out neither of them. Yeah. So Matthew coming forward to talk about the crime he actually committed, or yeah. Yeah, crime he actually committed, would, would rescue Alpha just as much. And yet he is making... Frankie feel like a worm from his position of utter privilege. He is the son of privilege. He will always be the son of privilege. He will be privileged boy for the rest of his life. And he is willing to throw his best friend to the dogs, as it were. <laughs> <laughs> and I think like, it's telling that he never noticed that the emails weren't from Alpha. No one, ha except for Alpha, obviously, had any indication whatsoever that this guy who they're they're totally, they're brothers, they're dogs together, that this wasn't actually his voice. She doesn't yeah. really disguise her voice in the emails. You're like, right. she, she, she tones yeah. down, like, she's not being abrasively feminist, and there are times in the text where she does get abrasive about it. But yeah. beyond that, she's talking in her voice in the same kind of, yeah. like, and she has, a, like, it's a great memorable voice in the text, and it comes through even in the emails, so I don't... The fact that they didn't pick that up shows that they weren't they paying that much attention Alpha. to Frankie, and they weren't paying that much attention to Alpha. No. Well, I think it shows that the that love between the dogs that they keep calling love, I think, you know, it, it's not personal in a certain way. Mm. It's positional. Mm. It's the, they love each other because yeah. of their each other's role as another Basset, which is not as connected to each other's actual like human individuality as they might be claiming it is. Does that make sense? Yes. yes, which explains, I mean, when Matthew is so obnoxious about Porter and is bu secretly bullying Porter because Porter has stepped out of line just mm -hmm. a little bit, also because Porter is spending time with his girlfriend or whatever, but I mean, again, it's the positional, Right. it has nothing to do with... It's that real person as a human, mm -hmm. it's just the position they're in. Well, and that's the conversation that Matthew has with Frankie when... Oh, Frankie. Oh, Matthew. Oh. <laughs> just wanted her to... Coming back to what I wanted out of Frankie, I wanted Frankie to say something to Matthew just there's some way of oh. understanding that she understood what a ridiculous jerk he was being. I keep moderating my language for this video. Oh, um, because I don't... Should we? Should we? No, I, well, I don't know. Yeah, because... Yeah, okay. Yeah. It just th 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 there's that moment where he's saying it's about loyalty, and that loyalty is totally positional for him. It's got nothing to do with ethics. Yeah. It's got nothing to do with morality. It's got nothing to do with what's right, what's legal, what's what's fair. It's it, all it is is loyalty, which is this blind positional yeah. thing. We are dogs, so we are loyal. Although loyalty apparently does not include coming forward to prevent your economically disadvantaged friend from getting expelled. And right. even if they, even if he doesn't want to come out as, you know, against the fact that Alpha might be expelled, he could have come out against the fact this shouldn't be a suspendable offense. You know, yeah. moving the gummy. Mm -hmm. Like there are plenty of ways not to incriminate yourself that also are supportive. Right. And he didn't choose any of those. Yeah. Heck, Matthew is charismatic enough. He probably could have like riled the student body towards fighting against the but suspension that's not what he does. or talked yeah. the the what was the head have headmaster into yeah. what needed to happen yeah. but he wouldn't even do that about the salad bar yeah i hate him so much. oh god i hate him <laughs> okay another thing we're all agreed on <laughs>